Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are in the world today. It's Saturday. Yay, the weekend is here. I still have to go to work, but you know, I don't know why, but even when you work on a Saturday, it still feels like the weekend, so it's all good. It's a beautiful day here, the tour down under is on, so there are cyclists everywhere. Um, and yes, I said cyclist with a touch of venom in my voice. Let me turn Ren down. Sorry, Ren. Um, but they're everywhere. They're everywhere. They're on the pavement. They're on the roads. They're on the beach walk. They're everywhere. Oh my God, cyclists. Anyway, this isn't about cyclists today. I'm not jumping on here to whinge about cyclists. Um, but I am going to tell you another really quick story about when I worked in a high school. And this was in a metalwork slash woodwork lesson. And the male teacher was doing a demonstration uh, for the students on why we don't wear ties when using a sand belter, an upright sand belter. I don't know whether you know what I mean, but like an upright sand belter. And so he was doing this demonstration and he had a tie on. And back then students had ties on. We all wore, they all wore ties uh, at this school, in high school. And he was showing them how if you have your tie loose and you lean forward and you turn the button on, how your tie can get caught up in the sand belt and choke you. Well, needless to say, this demonstration showed them exactly what would happen. And this teacher, his tie got caught up in the sand belt and went speedily whoop, like this straight towards the machine luckily he had the foresight to hit the emergency stop button really really quickly but that was a demonstration that I think none of them forgot and um, none of them ever forgot to tuck their ties in or take them off uh, he won a brick that year in the staff meeting an award which we used to give out for the silliest things that teachers had done and uh, so yeah he won the brick that year and deservedly so I would say deservedly so but another very funny story from um, high school days. There are so many. They just, every now and then, they come back to me, just these odd little stories from high school. So I will uh, relay them. I'm sure there are loads of people on here relaying um, funny stories from workplaces and working in schools, etc., etc. But I have a plethora of them as I worked with emotional behavioural children and then I worked with severely handicapped children so I have an awful lot and all of them I have to tell you will be funny none of them are going to be sad they're all going to be funny and not morbid because some of the stories could be morbid with some of the places I've worked but we're going to stay away from those because we want positive we want positive people you don't need to know all the dark 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 stuff that goes on and I don't mean by staff or anything like that just some of the sad sad stories that do go on in high school that a lot of people don't realize um so i'm going to try and focus on the funny stories and keep them rolling and uh, just hopefully give people a little giggle in the morning when they wake up or a little giggle at night before they go to bed i'm also going to um, do a little bit of research on what the hell is this thing that everybody keeps saying where they say woman instead of women i'm sure someone's going to jump on here and correct me but why? why? Why has woman turned in... Why, why do we say woman instead of women now when we're talking about plural of the female species? So, anybody knows, let me know. But I am actually going to do a post on that because I don't know why. I don't know whether it's my age. I don't know whether it's because I'm hitting that, that bracket of I can whinge about things. My job always whinged about things. But it, it, for some reason it rubs me up the wrong way people it just rubs me up the wrong way I don't know why but it rubs me up the wrong way I wish people would say women instead of saying woman when they mean women I'm going to research I'm going to find out how that happened I'm going to find out where that came from and why the new generation love you all you're all great but why you all say woman instead of women anyway that's about it for now because I do have to head for work have a great day, everybody. If you're just waking up, good morning. Have a lovely day. If you've just got home from work, have a lovely night. If you're going to bed, sweet dreams. And I'll talk to you all really, really soon. Bye. Oh, also, don't forget, be nice to retail staff. Be nice to retail staff. And remember to subscribe. That'd be lovely. All right, thanks. Bye.